All right, today we're gonna bring a PCI card and this is actually a, a for USB and we have USB 3.0 and type C, two type C's and two type A's, uh, 3.0. Now, what I want is actually this module. So, because um, I don't have space in my, my desktop for this. So we're gonna actually set up this smaller one in between a very cramped space. So, um, this is something that I wanted to do for quite a while because I ran out of USBs and this is extra USBs I require because I have everything that's type C now these days is taking in. I only had like two USBs on my actual desktop and, uh, one in the back in the, which is the motherboard and one in the front, but now I'm going to have two in the back and then extra USBs type three, th uh, 3.0. All right. So if you guys can see, here's in the back of my computer and I plugged in the actual keyboard here. Of course, we have two more USBs, uh, Type C's, and one more to go. So, right, just to show you guys, we're gonna plug in the mouse, all right, to make sure we have an active mouse. Even though I have a wireless, I'm just gonna plug this one in. Just to show you guys, look at this; it's working very well. In fact, look at this, I'm moving the mouse, so it works very well. Um, all right, to make sure that you install the keyboard. Uh, on your Windows, you can right click on it here, go to the device manager, right? When you right click here on the actual window icon, go to device manager, all right? Click on device manager, it's, this is gonna pop out. Now, I have this issue where my keyboard wasn't working when I plugged everything. It actually took a bit, and if you have experienced the same issue, all you gotta do is go refresh up here, and it'll scan your system. Um, you gotta have internet access because it's gonna download automatically the driver into the system. Once it does that, I see it here. If you guys can see it, there's there in the bottom already. They're installed devices, included with the rest of the USBs, but they're picked up real quick and they're working. I got my keyboard working and everything else. In fact, look at the keyboard comes up. I just popped that out right now so you guys can see that with the keyboard working. So very simple, easy to use. And if you have the same kind of problems that I did, you gotta modify your, your back of your computer, then go ahead and do it. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video.